Alright, so, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we're doing the best pack opening you will see. And you've seen by the title how many millions of coins we've earned from this pack opening. So you better stay in for till the end because there's good players and Team of the Seasons right till the end. So, let's get right into it. And before we get into it, if you already have it, make sure you like and subscribe because this is going to be the best Team of the Seasons pack opening. We're going to start off with some, okay, maybe not the best packs, but... These clips are been around for ages. I've had just lying around, but I didn't want to just do a couple EFL tots, a couple of this. I wanted to do a big pack opening, combine the last three weeks of packs that I've been working on into one big video, and this is it. Let's start with the EFL tots, and of course, I do know who I get until the Premier League. So, Premier League is one I'm looking forward to to open. I'm going to start with the EFL tots. Um, we do know that EFL aren't the best, but they do have some gems like Phillips, like Mitrovic, like so many other cards. We start off with Walkout, English right winger for Oxford. So initially, of course, I didn't know this player. And it's Henry. Um, Henry the Hoover, of course. Um, it does look the best and definitely a waste of coins. Um, but the thing with the unlike other YouTubers, these are guaranteed packs that you, I didn't spend any actual money to get. I, we, it just included loads of grinding on loads of different accounts as well. That's why we're getting so many of these different uh, players. As you see, different team of the seasons. We go with another team of the season. And I'm pretty sure there's only one or two EFL tots that aren't a walkout. And of course we get one because pack luck is something that's always on my side. Uh, we do get a keeper from, don't even know what that team is, I know a YouTuber called Pieface sort of supports that team, so I guess that's um, a bit alright. But these ones you never expect something good, there's only like two really good ones you can get, like Mitrovic, like Phillips would be absolutely amazing. Um, Phillips is like a young Gerard, maybe as good as Gerard's prime at the moments. And you can see big flares just to get a Serbian walkout striker, and yes, Fulham, it is Mitrovic, an absolutely amazing pool. And you see his stats, that looks so amazing. It's just a bit unlucky that he won't be in the Premier League next year. So that's why he can't get many good links. So he probably should leave uh, Fulham uh, to improve his career. But you see he's worth around 80k at the time. That person is probably just a bit stupid, trying to sell him for 400k. Around 80k at the time. Of course, now he would have gone down in price. But looked quite a decent card. And with these pack openings, we're going to get straight into the Premier League. Oh no, it is the Community Tots actually, by mistake. Community Tots was, of course, around the same time as the EFL Tots. We get a German, a lot of Germans, Cam, and it's Julian Brandt. And of course, I've done a player review on. If you want to, it will be in the link in the description. If you want to see a player review on this Brandt, he's absolutely amazing. Um, one of the best players I have used to this day, for price anyway. Of course, around this time, he's around probably... 170k is what it looks like. Um, that guy is going to probably get a bargain. 170k for the Julian Brand. Absolutely amazing card. We move to another community tots. I know so many teams this season. So high paced. That's why getting all of them shoved into one video. Which I hope you all enjoy. And probably have another one of these. A bit later on in the year. Maybe for totties. I mean. Um, so when you get the pink cards of course. We get open another one. Elisa is a wall card. There is quite a few ones that you can get which are decent. German again, goalkeeper this time, so it's not going to be Brandt. It's in fact going to be Leno, which I honestly don't know how he got one. Community Tots, he's been okay for Arsenal, but come on, it's Arsenal. You're not going to have how many goals they've conceded. How has he got into them? And 50k, well deserved. He's, there's so many other goalkeepers better than him in the Premier League anyway. But now we move on to the red picks. Of course, I did mention this before. You're going to have so many team seasons. We've got, of course, the EFL and Community Tots. And with the EFL, you get some decent players, but you're mainly looking for the Community Tots. The Joe Gomez is the Felipe Andersons, the Julian Brandts. Of course, I do know who we're going to get, but we're going to keep the drama just for you guys. Hopefully, we can hopefully get someone absolutely amazing. Start off with Sergio Busquets, an absolutely big, big, massive pick. Uh, of course, 93 rated. He is the highest rated one. Him... Uh, of course, he's not maybe the most expensive, but it's quite a usable card. I have used him a couple of times. He's very, very usable, especially with his big pace upgrade. Still 65, though, which is a bit terrible. If you think about it, in Team of the Season, with the upgrade, it's still only 65. But 
you move on to the next player of the pick um, and of course this is gold uh, gold 3 in fact which isn't maybe the best picks you can get but it's something where you don't have to stress too much and we get another highest rated one it is Godin and you see also Casemiro but realistically who are you going to use out of Godin and Casemiro especially if you've already got Sergio Busquets Godin doesn't even look that usable, especially because there's so many Serie A centre-backs now. Skrinovic, so many other. It's Inter Milan, which one's the better? And we also do get Lucas Leiva, the uh, other Liverpool player, but we go for the La Liga, CDMs, Casemiro and Sergio Busquets. Personally, I would say this is quite good. Cause I've seen other people who have just got an absolute rubbish, and but at the same time, I have seen people getting Joe Gomez's. So, for once in any FIFA's person's career, this is actually quite good, thank you EA, which is quite surprising isn't it? I think that sums up my reactions, but now we're in live, so I don't know who we're going to get for these Premier League tots. Now this was a week ago, those EFL ones, but now we're in the Premier League, the big ones. Sadly we also have the Saudi League, which, you know, is not the most uh, desirable league you can get, but honestly I will take I would take quite a few players. I've played with a lot of them. A Jamie Vardy, I've seen a lot of people get. Rashwoods, they're both absolutely amazing. I think but the big one we're looking for is a KDB and a VVD. The two uh, two picks for a De Bruyne and a Van Dijk. And it, we're going to get a Kovacic and Alisson. Alisson isn't bad, I guess. He is quite a decent player. And also a uh, really solid goalkeeper, I guess. And... Kovacic was never going to get picked over Alisson. But at least we can get a Van Dijk to get a nice link with him now, hopefully. Uh, as long as it... Soyinku would have been the worst player in the world, I guess. But I, I don't know because how usable he would be, especially with Lynx. He's only Turkish. Um, but no, we're going to keep positive thoughts. And we're going to keep having the positive thoughts of getting VVD. And then maybe we can afford a Joe Gomez to go next to him with the Liverpool trio. And we don't. In fact, we get Alisson again. Uh, a damage Traore, I guess, is probably the most... Uh, actually, a damage card, oh, that was maybe the worst picks you can get. Him and Dean Henderson. Okay, that's quite unfortunate. Um, yeah, that's just typical EA, I guess. Now, you've seen my red picks. And, of course, this was a while ago. But this is not live, this clip of me opening some 100k packs in the lightning round. But it was just a couple cards that I wanted to show you. So we're going to start off with the 45k packs, of course. I do know who we get, and this is why it's going to be in this uh, video, because it is something very good. And also, it spent a lot of money onto this pack, so I just want to see what you get for how much you spent. Of course, we get a board there. It's French, probably, a, I can't remember now, it's Tolisso. Oh no, it's Digne. Digne, very, very um, meme player now, after Nepenthe said, of course, I'm not going to reenact it, because I probably say I'm stupid when I do it, but... He is actually quite a usable card. I had him for like 600 games. But now, just to get even, so we get open 200k packs now. Jumbo rare player packs. I'm going to start off, never going to open these ones. As a board, yeah, absolutely terrible. And I skipped these because I just can't be asked to see them. Because, especially in the lightning round, we do get uh, Pablo Hako Alcacer. I don't even know how to say his name. The old Dortmund striker. And yeah, that was an absolutely terrible pack. But I guess what the EA are doing is just trying to, you know, maybe give me something, a couple terrible cards, see if I carry on, then maybe give me the big, big player, as I do know that's coming up. Now, I'm not going to go crazy on it when I see it again. Of course, I'll be happy. But of course, you see, team of the season, and you might be thinking, oh, there's loads. Argentinian, striker, Man City, we actually got... Sergio Aguero, one of the best tots you can get in the Premier League. Of course, now, this was a week ago, so this was when the Premier League was out. One of the best cards that you could have got. I remember at the time, I wish I was, I was happy I was recording, but I wish I had my live reaction. Three million coins at the time. Of course, I sold them straight away, but first I wanted to just play a couple games with them. Sadly, I didn't get a player review because this was in around weekend league, but Sergio Aguero, how crazy is that? Absolutely amazing card. 3 million coins. As you can see, 3.2, probably even more. Um, I'm happy I sold it straight away because he's gone plummeted down in price. But absolutely fantastic. 
This is an absolutely amazing pack. I saw sold him straight away. Victor Moses in the pack for good luck. And that was the last 100k pack I could afford. And that's what I got. Absolutely fantastic how that was. But let's get into some other packs. Now we're here live once again for the La Liga Tots. And you're never going to see this ever again. Where I'm opening so many teams this season. And as you've seen in the title, we got the number of how many millions of coins we've earned. And we start for the Dutch centre mid for the La Liga. It's going to be Frankie de Jong. Absolutely crazy pull there. That's a big, big W there. He's probably absolutely crazy how much it'd be worth. I don't know, maybe a million? Absolutely crazy how that would be. Uh, one million coins. Absolutely amazing. Wow, that's absolutely fantastic. That's as good as his team of the season. I mean, team of the year, of course. Now on the second La Liga top, but we're going to first go into the Super League one, of course. The Super League do have a couple good ones. I just hope I don't get the duplicate donk or something. It is a walkout. Please don't. It is, um, oh my god, it is donk. Yep, the one player I said I didn't want, and it is him. You can see, duplicate, already got him. Sadly, wasn't recording when I did get him, so that's a, yeah, absolutely terrible player there, but... Now we're into the La Liga tots again. There's so many good ones you can get. There's the Cruz, which is quite a usable card now, which is quite interesting. But a Messi, of course, is a big one. We do get a walkout. I think you'll guarantee the walkout. German is a Cruz again. Oh no, it is Ter Stegen. Yeah, that's quite unfortunate. And that was on my main account. Absolutely lovely. That was. Uh, that was. Yeah, that's really unfortunate. Hopefully, we get something better in the next ones. Of course, these won't be on my account. You see, he's a. Uh, 200, oh, okay, yeah, okay, yeah, he just keeps on going lower and lower in price. He's actually a really good goalkeeper, though. I have his 91 UCL one, but now into the last one. This isn't on my account, sadly, it's on someone else's, but I'm gonna get straight into it. Messi is, of course, the best one you can get, it's just so obvious, but let's see who we get. It opening and it is a walkout. Oh, God. Okay, the worst thing is you get Argentina right wing and he's called it, but it's French left. Oh, okay. So we have just packed Griezmann. Absolutely amazing pull there. Wow, he's okay. I would be going a lot more crazy if it was on my account, of course. Sadly, it's not. But wow, that's absolutely a fantastic pull. You can see absolutely amazing stats 96 pace, 95 shooting. See, how much is he worth? Maybe a million. Actually, maybe not a million, maybe 800k, six, yeah, I, I don't know. He's probably worth a lot of coins. But I hope you really enjoyed this pack opening. This did take me three weeks to do, so if you did enjoy it, make sure you like and subscribe if you already haven't. This will be all for me. Peace.